Hi guys, welcome to our travel vlog. How excited are we? We are so excited. We've been looking yeah. forward to this all year and obviously with what's gone on, we honestly didn't expect to be going away. Yeah, I really wasn't expecting to. If you did know, we had Texas planned in the summer. Quite obviously that didn't go ahead and we, we'd had this book, Germany, uh, for about a year, wasn't it? Yeah, about last sep September we booked. In the last couple of weeks I was thinking, oh, we're not going to be able to go. But the yeah. rate, like the infection rate's been fine. In Germany, um, yeah. yeah. But we are so grateful to be going away. We are, we're very grateful. Yeah, um, we are flying from London Stansted. I, I've never been to this airport. Have you, you haven't, I've, I've never been no. to this airport, but a couple of years ago I went to South End with yeah. my mum. Um, and this airport, I think it took us about three, is it about three and a half hours to get down here? Yeah, about well, well, four hours. If you know we're from the north, uh, well, northeast. So normally we fly to Manchester, uh, fly, drive to Manchester, fly <laughs> from Manchester Airport. Uh, but basically we originally had flights booked from Manchester to Eindhoven in the Netherlands. Once um, Holland got put on the non-exempt list, yeah. uh, we had to cancel that flight. And we basically we looked around and found that Stansted had cheapest. the cheapest and best flight times yeah. to Dusseldorf Airport. We could have flown from Manchester or Newcastle to Dusseldorf, but I think it was it was really expensive, like Newcastle flights and things. So we just thought, yeah. we'll just drive down to London on the Saturday. It's not like, take a bit of time and stuff and have a meal. And yeah, so obviously- It works out better, doesn't it? Yeah, we're going for food. Won't be a, a long vlog at all this. We're just gonna show you, do a quick room tour. As you can see, we're at the Travel Lodge. And we actually only paid thirty pound each for. Uh, I a found room. it because yeah. Tom originally a book. Did you book a premier the in? Premier in, yeah. And that was quite expensive. It was one hundred and ten for both of us because we actually my mum and dad are here. Um, and then I just found this. Like we got, I got an email and I was like, oh, let's book this. And yeah. it's four minutes. There's four not minute wrong drive. with it to be fair. Like it's right by the airport. It's just somewhere to get your head down, it isn't it? It was so easy to check in as well, wasn't yeah. it? And it smelled so clean. Yeah, it's nice. So we do have a morning flight. We fly at about five to eight, I think. So yeah, it will be an early start. So yeah, we're gonna chill out for a bit now, go for some food and then yeah, I can't wait. So basically this is another theme park holiday. Uh, our Europe trip from last year, we went through Holland, Belgium and Germany and we did seven different theme parks across the week. Uh, it's going to be very similar this trip. We're doing six theme parks across seven days and yeah, we're just so, so excited. I'm just just looking forward to just getting on holiday and yeah. the weather next week is meant the to be hot. The weather looks amazing. It's, yeah. uh, I don't understand, but I think they've got a mini heat wave and then I think on Monday it's like 31 degrees. Yeah. So obviously we are mainly in Germany. However, we are also still going into the Netherlands. Basically when we booked this, uh, we had a uh, plan to go to Toverland and Efteling. And yeah, we just couldn't not go to Efteling. No. It's one of our most favourite theme parks in Europe. We've worked it out because yeah. of obviously I'm working at home, so I'm able to quarantine at home. Yeah. Um, and Tom, you're going to take some time off, aren't you? Well, yeah, I've booked. So basically how it works is because we're leaving Holland on the Monday and then we're going into Germany for the remainder of that week, when we fly home, uh, we technically we have to quarantine for eight days. Uh, once we're back into the yeah. UK, which is completely fine because, uh, like you say, you work from home and I'm, I've am i took the week off yeah, work exactly. um, and if needs be, I could have worked from home as well, but yeah, it's going to be fine. Our parents as well are, are and, already yeah. off, so it works out Our perfect. parents, your parents. Oh, no, our parents. My parents, my mum and dad. Yeah, <laughs> Stacey's uh, mum and dad are coming with us for this trip. They're not going to be in the vlogs loads. You may see them in the background. We might get their opinions on the likes of Taryn, some of the... My dad's good excited ride. for Taryn. He is excited, yeah. He was looking yesterday and he was like, we're going on try. I was like, yeah, <laughs> at Overland. Yeah, so obviously join us for this uh, Europe, uh, well, German and Holland trip. Run down the parks now. I don't even know where to start. There's so many that we're so excited to yeah. do, get back to. Some old and some new, which we've never done. Uh, so in the morning then, when we land in Dusseldorf, we're picking up the car hire and we're getting straight down to Toverland. We're uh, going to be tired, aren't we? We are going to be tired, <laughs> but with Toverland, it's a funny one. We've done this park twice, but each time we've been, we've been limited to how long we can stay because we've been catching flights. On uh, the afternoon. So we've been there about three, three and a half hours, both yeah. times. I just can't wait to have a full day there and yeah. be able to get like loads of re-rides in. Because last time, the area around like Phoenix and stuff was absolutely stunning. Yeah, Beautiful. 
but I love the boat ride as well. I just Merlin's want it, Quest. Merlin's Quest. Yeah. I just want to get back on it and be able to go on four or five times. We should get a full afternoon in Torvaland, so it will be nice to properly yeah. uh, do the park at a slower pace. Yeah, but then like I say, on the Monday, we are going up to Efteling. So excited to get back there. I've done this park twice now. You've been three times. And is it free? Yeah, it's, well, it's yeah. one of my favourite theme parks. I absolutely it is. love it's it. It's one of mine as so well. Magical. It's just so magical. I love the food. <laughs> yeah, this, the pancakes. Uh, it's like I say, after that, we are leaving Holland and we will be spending the rest of the trip in Germany. So we're driving over to Fantasialand for the Tuesday. Again, another one of our favourite theme parks in Europe, obviously, for Taran. And there's rumours going around about Fly, but I think we're just going to miss it. I don't, I can't, I can't see Fly opening. I know obviously they've been testing it and the, staff. and the staff have been on it, but yeah, I just, I think we will miss it by a couple of weeks, sadly. But it's definitely something to go back it's for again. It's just something to go back for, yeah. isn't it? But, but obviously um, we're going to get all the latest updates from that area. So that'll be good. On the Wednesday, we're driving down our first ever visit to Tripstrill. I'm really looking forward to this park. Yeah. It looks stunning. I've seen so many people do updates from when they've been away, and it just looks it just looks so much It does. Fun. I, when I've, I haven't been to a park before, I tend not to look really. I like, don't I, look a lot. I don't really know what's I've there. Seen, to I be have honest. seen some photos and stuff. Yeah, I know, I know they have two new coasters, so yeah, it'll be good to do all the rides there, get some new coaster credits. Uh, Thursday and Friday. I'm finally getting back to Europa <laughs> Park. Uh, I haven't been there for three and a half years. Obviously, you went with your mum a couple of years yeah, ago. Yeah, I went for Halloween mm. um, about two years ago. But yeah, I'm just looking forward to going back. And we're actually going to the water park on Thursday night. Yeah, we are. We're doing Rulantica on the Thursday evening. Yeah, so there'll be day one and day two vlogs from Europa Park. Obviously, being such a big park, you do need two days to yeah. properly appreciate it. And yeah, and then Saturday, we're ending the trip at Holiday Park, another new park for us. Obviously, I can't wait to get on Expedition GeForce. I've heard so many great things. Again, I, this is a park I haven't really looked at. Mm. I know we, we, I've seen, obviously, a few vlogs and stuff, but I don't want to, like, look too much into it. Oh, it's going to be good, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And then, obviously, we're driving back up to Dusseldorf Airport, where we fly home. But don't want to think about that yet. No, We, we haven't yet. even started. So, yeah, that is the trip. Uh, eight vlogs to come including this one so it's going to be great it's going to be a brilliant week we're going to be so excited <laughs> all week long not thinking we were getting away this year but yeah it looks like we it's are. mad isn't it it's just a, it's such a crazy year yeah while we're here then i'll just show you our room uh, obviously in like i say in the travel lodge nothing spectacular but again it's nothing too it's bad to get your head down there yeah. you lovely view on the ground <laughs> floor <laughs> Yeah, it's been a lovely day, hasn't yeah, it? The drive been, down was nice. We're so close to the reception and like getting out. Yeah. I want to be like higher. Yeah, so obviously we've just got bed, got USB charging points, got TV. And the bathroom's tiny. Bathroom small. It is really small. Got extra coffee, I, I need a coffee. I don't know how to get the fan off. I know it's a bit loud, isn't it? But yeah, this is tiny, really small, but. Just for a quick shower in the morning, isn't it? Yep, that's it. We're going to chill out now and yeah, we'll quickly show you the food we have at the meal tonight. And then yeah, we'll be getting up early and getting on the plane. What time are we getting up? Oh, four, I think. Early Not looking start. forward to that at all. <laughs> Right, so we've come for some food. Where, where have we come? Is it the Swan? The Swan yeah. Inn, I think it's called. I'm, yeah. not, I'm not sure exactly where we are. It's a really nice looking village. It's about though. 20 minutes yeah. near Stansted. About a 20 off. minute drive from where we are. Um, yeah, just very quickly then, because we are tired and very hungry, yeah, I'll just quickly show you the food we've got. It looks very nice actually. Um, I've gone for the Hunter's Chicken, uh, which is like chicken and bacon, chips, garlic bread. I've got lasagna. Ice burger. Barbecue burger and you've got lasagna as well. Yeah, and I'll, of course I had to get cheesy <laughs> chips and yeah. just Stilton sauce. <laughs> I'm starving so I'm going to tuck into this. Yeah, and also obviously a nice drink here. We're going to eat this now. Very tired, so yeah, uh, get this, get home, run home, back to the travel lodge <laughs> and yeah, get some sleep. It's Tomorrow. a very early start, so yeah, we'll see you in the morning.
morning. Morning. Oh, we're so tired, aren't we? Very tired. <laughs> We've been up since quarter to four. I and think we got about four hours sleep. Yeah, it, by the time we obviously got back last night and it was about 10 o'clock, wasn't yeah. it? Nice food, by the way. We had really Good. nice food. Um, the bed was comfy as well. Nothing wrong with Definitely it. recommend that hotel right near the airport. It was nice. Yeah. And now I've just got, obviously, a pint of cider. That's too early for me. I've got Orange. Orange is got orange. Uh, yeah, so you can see we've um, gone to London Stansted for the first of its time. Actually, pretty impressed with this airport. It's lovely, isn't I it? I thought it's really nice. We're just sat in the weather spoons right yeah. now, and it's really clean. It took about ten minutes to get through. Yeah. Um, obviously travelling. Surprisingly busy as well. It is quite busy, and yeah. obviously travelling in this like with what's gone on, I thought it would be dead complicated, but it was it was dead simple. Yeah, everyone. Well, um, most people have got their masks. Uh, on. Yeah, and obviously. When you sat down, you don't need to have your mask on while you're having a drink or food, but I'm just excited to go. I won't feel relaxed until we're there. Yeah. Will you? Nah, no, well, I'm pretty certain we're going now. We should be boarding in about an hour. Yeah. We're just really excited, but we are tired. But no, I'm just really surprised about how many people are flying still. It's a lot busier than we thought. Yeah. yeah looking forward to getting on a plane again. Been yeah. it, well just over a year since our last trip. Yeah, so, so we're flying to Dusseldorf about an hour and ten minutes, I think. Yeah. Not long at all, really. And then, yeah, we'll be picking up the car, show you the car we're getting, and then we'll be on our way to Toverland. Yeah, just can't, can't wait. Dead excited. But yeah, we'll drink this and we will see you when we get on the plane. So we've got off the plane. How short was that? About 50 minutes, 50 wasn't minutes it? 50 minutes it took. Yeah, it flew by. So weird. <laughs> Literally. Like, it's so quiet. Yeah, I mean, compared to Stansted, this is probably the quietest airport we've ever been in. It's, it's absolutely really dead. Yeah. It's sad as well because yeah. obviously all the shops and stuff are shut. Everything's um, shut. And even when I was at Stansted, normally I get like a lipstick or something. Mm. And I understand it, obviously you can't get the testers, no perfume, mm. so like all the shop assistants were just stood around where they're doing yeah, nothing. So sad. Just uh, turn you around, show you just how quiet yeah. it is. <laughs> Nobody here at all. Well there is. Well there, there is. <laughs> There's, There's a couple of people from our flight. Yeah, so we're going to collect our baggage now. Yeah. To be fair, wearing this mask on the flight didn't even bother me. No. I was panicking about it, but I just went to sleep. It was fine, yeah. <laughs> it was dead quick. Yeah, no problems on the flight. It was pretty bit, well, about three quarters full, I'd say. But yeah, Dusseldorf Airport. It's really quiet. I've got our car for the week now. It's lovely as it's well. It's really nice. We've actually just been upgraded because the yeah. one, the red one and that blue There's a one couple there. Cars there. Basically, uh, we obviously got four suitcases and th it wasn't big enough. You booked for a big one. I though. did. Yeah. So obviously they've uh, they've apologised. It's lovely. The car. They gave us this one. There's plenty of room in the boot and ST line as mm -hmm. well. Yeah. Really nice. Nothing wrong with it. Uh, we booked through Enterprise. 
dead straightforward. Uh, you come out of the airport, mm -hmm. uh, walk, turn left, cross the bridge, and you're on floor seven where Enterprise yeah, is. Yeah, and the woman was really helpful. Wasn't yeah, she? I think we only paid around two hundred and forty pounds between four like of that, us for the week, which isn't bad at all. So yeah, it's been such a, an easy um, morning. Yeah, like, yeah get, really getting nice. here since we've uh, started at London Stansted up we, to this point. So we simple. are a little bit tired, but Knackered. we're just excited to get to Toverland. Yeah, because yeah. it's about eleven o'clock now. In forty minutes' time, we will be in Toverland. Eating. Can't believe it. Yeah. So in a couple hours, you'll be on Troy and Phoenix. Yes. <laughs> so stay tuned for the next vlog which will be from there yeah we'll get a couple of shots of the journey up to Torvaland. i think it's around 40 to 50 minutes from here yeah yeah i would recommend dusseldorf airport if it's you great. if you're wanting to do a trip similar to this uh obviously really good. yeah fantasia land's close by yeah i'd say Torvaland is and you're Eftelin. right next to like the netherlands and yeah. into germany and i think it's really yeah. easy isn't it yeah so yeah it's been great going to get in the car now get to Torvaland it's open till seven o'clock and yeah we'll end the vlog there let's go Right, so we've made it to Torvaland. You can definitely feel the difference in temperature. It's so hot. It is getting really warm. We've just put our sun cream on. Yeah, because I'll, I'll burn sure easily. He's got it all on. <laughs> yeah, well, you've got it on your nose still. Oh, is it still on my nose? Yeah, it's still yeah. on his nose. Yeah, just uh, parking up. We've just seen Troy and Phoenix going round. So, so excited to get in. Obviously, that is the next vlog coming up. So, uh, make sure you stay tuned for that one. But yeah, hope you've enjoyed this short travel yeah. vlog dead simple getting here really yeah. simple and yeah easy to get to and definitely recommend traveling to Dusseldorf if yeah. you're going to do this trip yeah definitely but yeah uh, thank you for watching uh, we will see you in the next sure. vlog from Torvaland yes. going in now for some food we're starving <laughs> but yeah <laughs> if you haven't already subscribed to the channel please do also leave a like yeah. and a comment you can also get us on Facebook Instagram and Twitter if you just search Tom and Stace and yeah we will see you in the next vlog from Torvaland yeah.